All right, so I'm gonna do a, a series of videos here about using, finding your directions if you don't have a map or a compass with you and some of the, the things you can use in nature that will help you, help you get your direction. And this is the shadow stick method. And this is gonna be a simple version of it, but um, it'll give you the idea of what to do. What you basically do is you'll put a, some kind of stick in the ground or some, something somewhere flat where it, it's able to cast a shadow and it's not gonna get the shadow is not going to get messed up as it runs through the terrain as you're getting these these shadows. So what we'll do is we'll just kind of clean this off a little bit where our shadow is going to, where we think it's going to run anyway. And then what we'll do, our first point here, we'll just grab something. Let's say we grab just a pine cone for right now um, and we'll get some rocks here in a second. We're going to set right at the very edge of this. We're going to set one pine cone, and and as this travels every five, ten minutes or so, we're going to put another pine cone or a rock or something, and eventually this will make a line. And then I'll explain how you can use that line to figure out which direction you're pointed. So let's give this a minute, and we'll set up another one. Okay, so now we have the the second plot ready, and what we'll do is we'll put the stick right on the very end of that shadow. And then what we do is we wait for the third one and then the fourth one and then I'll kind of show you from there how you can get your direction. Okay, so now we set our fourth stick down. We know it's right here. So now we see this line that is going exactly this way and we know that, that this is east and west, but how do you figure out which is east and which is west? Well, the sun rises in the east and sets in the west. So this is, right now it's 11 o'clock in the morning. So I know the sun is coming down and it's casting a shadow towards the west. If it were afternoon, then the sun would come down and cast a shadow towards the east. So I know by this that these lined up, the shadow is going towards the west. And what I'll do is I'll take one of these sticks and try to get a stick as straight as possible. It's not crucial, but it, it'll give you a better, a more accurate reading. So I know that this is west, and if I put this right here at 45 degrees, I know that now that this is north right here, the way I was taught was never eat soggy Wheaties. So if I know this is north, you go clockwise, you go never eat soggy Wheaties, and that's west. So now if I had, a, had to travel north or northeast or anything like that, I would know which direction I needed to travel. Uh, I'll be doing a lot more videos on using nature if you don't have a compass or you don't have that stuff, using nature to to kind of find your direction and find out. You know, there's a lot of different things to do and I'll be doing videos on those. So stick around and I appreciate you listening.